Hello, today I'm going to show you how to make two super fun Valentine's crafts. The first one that we'll start with is this heart butterfly craft. For this craft, you're going to need a glue stick, scissors, and some pieces of paper. You'll need one piece of black paper that is pretty skinny, but also pretty long. Two pieces of pink paper that are pretty long and big. And two pieces of thick white paper. So um, I'm gonna show you a trick on how to cut those. So if you have a piece of paper here that's 11 by eight and a half inches, 11, eight and a half, then um, you can just cut off this side like this and you get a good length strip so um, you can make two of those and those will work for this for your pink strips and then to cut your um, your white strips you're going to cut across it like this and then you can also cut two of those to make the right length strips for the white piece of paper. Um, you can also do the same thing with the to make the black piece of paper is just cut across the shorter side and then that'll make it so that it's the right length. Um, the black paper needs to be a little bit thinner because the black paper will serve as the antennas later on. Okay, now that we've got all our materials, let's begin. The first step is to get your one pink piece of paper and you're going to fold it in half so that the two ends meet. And then crease it. So now it should be folded in half. So now you're going to fold the two, these two ends, you're gonna fold them together like this. And so that makes a heart shape. So you're going to fold them like this and you have a heart. So now let's glue those two ends together with your glue stick. So you can just glue this edge here and then bend it together and there we go. Now um, wait for the glue to dry and you can make another heart while you're waiting. So you're going to want to do the same thing with your other pink piece of paper and then your two white strips of paper. Okay, now you should have two white hearts that are both pretty small and then two bigger pink hearts. So you're going to want to take all your hearts and lay them out on the table as shown. Now you should have your hearts laid out on the table like this. As you can see, it kind of looks like a butterfly with this as head and then two wings. So, and that's what it's supposed to be. But um, now we're going to glue all the hearts together. So take your first heart, I'm gonna start with the head heart, and um, glue the two sides. So like glue this side right above the crease. So I'm just going to put some glue on there. So now I have glue on that side and I'm also going to put glue on the other side of the crease. Okay, now as you can see, I have glue all the way along the bottom and the sides a bit. So now I'm going to put it back with my hearts and press the two sides into the bigger hearts, like this. Now they're all connected. Okay, now um, continue this step with the bottom heart. So glue the two sides. And 
And then go to the other side. And then um, put the next part into the bottom, just like the first one. Now you can press it into here. And we have our butterfly. Now there's only one more step before we're done. So for this step, you're going to need your black strip. So um, start by cutting your black strip right in half. It doesn't have to be perfect, just approximately. Okay, now take one of the halves and bend down this end so that it folds into the other side. Like this. Um, do the same with the other side, too. For the other side, though, keep bending them over. Until you have sort of a curve. So now we're going to put our antenna on the butterfly. So we're going to start by placing. We're going, well, let's first see where we want to put it. So you can kind of move it around a bit and I think I'll put mine like right right here so I'm gonna put some glue on this bottom part and now I'm going to press this into the butterfly's head where I want it to go So there's one of my butterflies antennas, probably, and you can also move it around if you don't, if you want to move it, um, so I think I'll turn mine around and put it right here, there you go. Now repeat that step for this antenna. 